Hello everyone, in this video we will learn how to automatically send the confirmation email to your customers when payment is under review in Stripe Radar. So if you are selling something using Stripe Payment Gateway, then it happens that some payment transactions fall under review due to the elevated risk of fraudulent payments. To verify such payments, what exactly you do? You might have to send an email to your customers and ask them for some ID proof as a payment confirmation that it is done by a legitimate user only. So what if I tell you that you can completely automate this email sending process? Yes, whenever the payment is under review in Stripe, you do not have to manually send the email and ask them for verifying the payments. The emails will be sent automatically for every high risk or elevated risk payments. Yes, we will just have to integrate Stripe and Gmail using an integration and automation software Pabli Connect and the process of verifying the payment by sending email emails manually will be automated completely. So let's start the process. To create this automation, first open your browser and type pabblypabli.com slash connect and press enter and you will reach to the landing page of that automation software. Now if you are a new user, click on this button and create your free account. The account creation is absolutely free and you will also get 100 free tasks so that you can create this automation for free in Pabli Connect. Okay. Now if you are uh, already a user, click on access now. Alright, and you will reach to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Now here from this blue button, you will have to start creating your automation, your workflow, give any random name. Let's say I'm giving the name as send payment confirmation to customers when it is under review in Stripe. Okay, let me make it capital. Now click on create and you will see two boxes in front of you in which we are going to select our applications. Okay, let me show you these boxes. This is known as trigger and this is known as action. Let me show you trigger means when this happens, action means do this and here I'm going to select that whenever the payment is done in Stripe send the payment confirmation via Gmail to the customers okay this is how we are going to build this automation so in trigger event let's select the application as a Stripe and in trigger event I am going to select the event as new charge whenever there is a new charge in Stripe send the payment confirmation okay this is the webhook url copy it and with the help of this url only we are going to build the connection in between stripe and pabli connect okay instruction for the same is given here okay let me open the webhook setting of stripe i have reached to the dashboard basically to the webhook section okay and firstly i am going to enable this test mode okay now i am going to Click on this add endpoint and going to paste the same URL which we have received from, I'm sorry for that, which we have received from the Pabli Connect, okay? This is the same webhook URL which we have actually received from the Pabli Connect, okay? And I've pasted it and in the select event, again, you will have to select the new charge event, okay? Let me show you where is the charge, okay? Let me search with the name charge. Okay. You can see charge succeeded. You will have to select this particular event. Click on add events. Okay. And you will see your endpoint will be added into the dashboard of Stripe. Basically to the webhook section of Stripe. Now go back to Public Connect and let's see what it is asking. It is asking to log into the application where you have added the webhook url and do a test submission or record so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response so basically i am going to do the test payment in my stripe account okay so let's open the stripe account let me open some products and i am going to make a payment let's say i am buying this particular plan okay let me open the payment link for the same this is the payment link copy and open in a new tab and here i am going to make a dummy payment so that the data of the payment can be recorded here in pabli connect and further we are going to actually send the confirmation message to the customers okay assume that the email of the person is admin at the rate pabli card information well this is the stripe documentation where i have few card details for testing the stripe radar okay so let's say i am going to use this particular card okay i am copying it this is just a random test card okay paste it give any random details all right it is done 
any random CVV name of the card, let's say dummy user. Okay, dummy user is making the payment. Country is India. Click on subscribe. Okay, no thanks. And I am making the payment. Thank you for subscribing. That means the payment has been done successfully. Go back to Public Connect and see whether we have received the response or not. You can see the payment which we have just done. The response for the same has been received. Okay, let me show you the amount. All right, other details. Let me show you the name of the person. This is the email address. And this is how we have actually received everything. Okay, let me show you one more important thing here. The person who is making the payment having the risk score of 7070 and the risk level is elevated. Now, if the person who is making the payment having the risk level of elevated, in that case, I want to send the confirmation message. Something like, hey, please confirm that the payment you have just done is actually done by you only. Okay, how? Let me show you. So basically, firstly, I'll have to define it somewhere that whenever the, there is a risk level. Okay, let me show you how you can actually do it with the help of filter. Filter is an amazing feature of Pabli Connect with the help of which we can actually set different kinds of condition. And here I'm going to choose whenever the risk level is elevated and not just the elevated whenever the risk level is even highest in these two cases i want to send the confirmation message to the people okay so here also again i'm going to click on or condition and going to select the same condition once again let's search for the level once again and if any of the condition is true, it should send the messages to the customers. Okay, so basically what we have done, we have actually mapped this particular data here in the filter and how we have not done it manually by simply accessing the above data from this drop down. We have mapped it and finally set the conditions. Now going to click on save and send test request. Now you tell me what is going to happen, whether it is going to be true and false. Of course, the condition is going to be be true because here one of the condition is getting satisfied let me show you here the risk level is actually elevated okay in that case i want to send the messages okay that is why i'm going to click on this plus button and here i want to send the emails that is why i am going to choose gmail application and in my action event i am going to choose send email option click on connect and you will have to give the access of your account i have just connected my gmail account with pabli connect that is why i am going to use the existing connection you can actually give your credentials to public connect it is 100 percent safe don't worry now it is asking for the recipient email address so basically to whom you would like to send the message to the person who has just made the payment and where is the email id of the person let me search it here it is anbinatharate pablitudes.com and let me tell you one more important thing whatever the details i am mapping in the field okay these are going to change automatic let's say some other person is making the payment in that case also this email will be changed with the email of that particular person okay now the sender name let's make it as pabli in case of email subject i want to keep that hello or i can say pabli team the email is actually from the pabli team colon let me give a space here Please confirm your recent payment and reply needed urgently. Okay, this is going to be my subject line and in the email content, what should come? Well, I have prepared a nice template already in advance. Let me show you the template. Okay, and this is the email which I would like to send to the people. Let me show you this email. I'll show it. Don't worry. First, copy it and paste it in the content section or here. Okay, paste it. Let me do the formatting first. So basically, this is the template which I have created. This is the message which I would like to send to my customers. You can compose your email according to your choice completely. Okay. So let me show you the message once again. Hello. Here, I want the name of the person should come. So again, I can actually map it from where. 
simply map the data map the name of the person from the trigger response again search for the name and the dummy user has made the payment hello dummy user during the recent purchase of our abc email marketing software you have entered your information such as your address email address cards card details and so on unfortunately we are not able to verify your information therefore we ask you to send us the below information and i'm asking to provide the few details okay and further please send us the copy of your passport or national identity card and uh, we just we just need the information to authenticate your account in our database until then your account will be inactive looking forward to your response thanks and regards team pabli so i have composed my email okay and uh, i don't want to fill the rest of the details everything is looking good now i am going to click on save and send test request and i am expecting this message to be delivered to the same person automatically on his gmail okay so the response is received let me open the gmail account so i have opened the gmail account and you can see the person has received the, the email subject line is pabli team please confirm your recent payment reply needed urgently and hello dummy user during the recent purchase of our this particular product you have entered your information and you can see this is the same email which i have added where in the pabli connect email content field and this is how whenever the person who is making the payment if its payment is under review in stripe radar in that case is the automatic email will be sent now you do not have to send the email manually for the payment confirmation it is going to be done automatically i am also going to attach the link of the same workflow in my description box so that you can completely clone this scenario in your account for free all right and people ask me after watching the video tutorial that do they really need to do any particular settings also no once you have created this automation this setup in pabli connect simply close it and everything is going to be done automatically whenever the person is making a payment he or she will be getting the payment confirmation messages automatically if their payment is actually under the review in star in stripe radar okay not just these applications you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with pabli connect you can ask your queries at forum.pabli.com my team will surely answer to your questions this is the website of pabli connect and for the latest updates of pabli connect and unique automation ideas you can join our facebook group that is formget.deals if you have found this video helpful in any way share it with your friends and colleagues and also help them to automate their business like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video